47 and we finally caught our first Dorado two days before we get to Belize. Pretty happy right now. As you can see, he's inspecting our baby. Take a shot in his mouth. They just wanted some seaweed and then they go, fuck! Open wide, big boy. Dude, he's dead. He's dead, brother. By fucking time. Finally By got that. Time. We were supposed to pull through the reef at the least at the top of the barrier and um, have a beautiful day. Stop off at an atoll, aka a little island, and spend the day there before we do our last three hours tomorrow morning and go into the lease. But unfortunately, this morning when we woke up, Calypso decided to rape us. We got bent so hard to realize that we got rain in our face for four hours straight. It's so bad that I found Peter cooking in his underwear. Just difficult times, difficult times. He's so bleak, I haven't seen him so upset and so sad and so hungry in a long time. Good at all right now inside drinking cold beer. Oh. Yeah, it's the worst part of all is like we've had a 49 nine days of awesomeness. And then when you just think you're at the end of your trip, she rapes you. She took that strap on. <laughs> and put on some metal studs, put a nail through it, shoved it straight on us. Day 15. We finally got into Belize last night and once again it was dark so we didn't see where we were so we anchored right off like basically close to the base where we are. It looks pretty awesome yeah. The sun's just busy coming up and we've got a yacht coming past us. As you can see there's a yacht going past us here. Now we're welcome to Belize. Finally here, a little bit of rain as you can see but now it's clearing up quite nicely and we're here flat lagoon water in the distance, we've got island backed by mountain, fucking beautiful, glad to be here, Belize baby, what's here? As we finally reached Belize and it's our like dinner date, we went all out and we're gonna have a little bit of a good time. There's the food, kind of makes a choice, Mark with his Caesar cup, five star gourmet meal. Peter, I went to the this. I wouldn't have this cap and this mark turned around to save it just before we go to Port of Laser. So I gave it a little, little save it by Mark Hell Season. I always spill food on myself, so I've developed a little bit of food spill tie. Actually, I even spilled there. Like I'm trying to get it all of the time, and I still fucking spill. So yeah, that's me. Right, comes. What, what do I do on Tombo? You know it, bro. As you can see, baby Bob. Ah, oh, Bob Scare. It was the only lure that was left. Sail tie and cave because it's a tie event. Oh, and then just a little ensemble because you know I never wear a shirt. Nice. Oh, wait. Nice. If this was a rough, two fingers rough. Emancipate yourselves from mental slavery. Now, I tell you, skin free our minds. 